Hi everybody, today we are going to get a love message. So if this is where you are single or if you are in connection, we're just going to see a message that comes through and I was really trying to debate, am I going to do a message for singles, um, in connection? Um, so let's just see what comes through and see what kind of love message we are going to get today. Really put it out there to your spirit, guys. If this is a relationship that you are in and you want guidance, um, I feel like if this is a relationship that you want guidance, it's because I feel uh, a little bit of a struggle. So either singles or um, somebody who's struggling in their re relationship currently and you want like clarity or you want some guidance um, or are you singles out there or if you, you know, just want that clarity in your relationship. Okay, so we got two cards that fell out so whether you are single or you are in a current connection um you have a lot of sexual attraction attraction in to each other um and it is a lasting connection and some of you could have like known each other in the past and decided to reconnect or some of you um you know are having this new connection and it's somebody who like you kind of feel like you knew forever like you guys just know each other so well and you guys are so attracted to each other um let's pull some more cards change yourself okay so if you all right karmic flame love i feel like you want to get to a lasting connection okay um, you guys definitely want to get into a lasting connection, whether this be you or, um, this be the other person, like both of you guys are in the spot of wanting to get in a, that is so beautiful. You guys both want to get into the spot of like being together, right? Like you guys have dreams together for sure. That's what is showing spiritual awakening and journey is what is ending this. Okay. So for you, and I think this more goes for you. Um, in order to make this relationship work, if you are in this relationship currently, I think there is a lot of insecurities um, that you have. And it's like you guys are twin flames um, or you guys, you know, if this is a reconnection, it's like you guys used to um, have a past and you kind of like hold that past or you like use that past um for like why you're together today or it's like something about that where you need to let that go like you need to change your mindset into that you want to be with this person you guys are definitely very attracted to each other um you guys think about each other often um and it's like you but both of you let others influence you so whether this be it's like uh I wish that I could be single because of this, that, and the other, or um, I wish that my significant other would let me do this or that. It, it's because other people influence, and both of you guys are learning together. It's like um, you guys are both going through a spiritual awakening to realize that you guys want to be together. Um, you guys are making dreams together. Like you guys are working really hard. Let's just pull three more um, cards because the center of our reading was um, that you guys are definitely attracted. Attraction is high in this reading for whether this be a new connection or a um, existing connection. And if this is a new connection or somebody that you're going to go into, you need to change how you um, think. Um, and this person possibly could let others influence them and that would bother you often or you let others influence you. So you need to change that. If somebody's like, uh, I don't like this person because this, that, and the other, like that doesn't matter. What do you think? You know, like you don't need to let other people's um, like things influence you or thoughts. Like you need to really change your mindset going into something. And so this could mean like where you have past relationship trauma and you're going to let that like anything affect going into this relationship board. Whatever happened in your past with somebody else cannot reflect on the person that you are currently with, right? Because it's not their fault that that happened. And if you're not willing to heal from that yet, then you need to step away. And that's what is really coming through if this is a new connection, is that you really need to change that. Or if you're not ready to give up your single lifestyle or um, other people's like opinions or values, <clears throat> you need to change that. Because <clears throat> for example, like if you 
or with somebody and somebody says, um, somebody says like, you know, well, if you didn't have this person, you could go do this. Like, don't let that influence you because this person matters. And like, if you let somebody get in the middle, like this person will, like they know um, their value. And even though like that you'll matter to them, it's like, there's they're awakened and you need to go through that awakening um in order to keep this relationship like whatever was the past or anybody's voices opinions <clears throat> they can't matter to you um and if this is when somebody you're currently with you both need to push other people out because it's definitely like there's people sitting in the middle um that are like influencing and I keep getting reconnection. So this could definitely be somebody you are reconnected with. Um, this could be definitely somebody that you are reconnected with for sure. And it's definitely somewhere that you are meant to be. Um, you guys are a twin flame. There could be some things going on in your relationship currently. like, um, And that's it's not always bad, but I just feel like um, put it out there to your angels and your spirit guides, like that you want them to be revealed. And I feel like that's more like other people's influences. Like if this is like, maybe your other person is like being influenced by other people, like put it out there to spirits that like you want to be, um, like you really want a clear picture, but you and this person both want to grow ultimately. And that's like where they want to be. Um, and this could be you, like where there's some things going on inside you and you're asking your spirit guides to guide you to realize like this is where you want to be because you can't put the past behind. Um, and if this is, sorry if you hear my baby, she just woke up. Um, and if this is somebody like that you are reconnecting with, you need to put your past behind and ask your spirit guides to guide you because if not, the same things are going to kind of happen, you know? So let's pull some tarot. Oh, okay. Oh, so let's see. We knocked our trees over. All right, let's pull some tarot. It says endings right here. So we are putting some endings, um, and that's an ending to the past. We're going to go into this loving energy, and whatever that means for you, whether you want to um, move into where you're you know, in this current relationship and you're willing to put the past behind you and actually move forward and be with this person because you guys share the same dreams or you're ready to finally heal from the past and you're willing to go in this in a better mindset. You're confident, you're happy, you're ready for this love to come in for you. You're really um, like, it, it's like a strong, um, <clears throat> sturdy love that is going to come in for you. Um, let's pull just three more clarifiers. Oh, wow. I was going to get three, but this one just fell out. So we'll just take this, the star. You and this person um, definitely are meant to be together, whether this is a new connection coming in or somebody that you were asking about, whatever that is for you, that you and this person are meant to go to be together. There's a lot of things that you need to um, put behind you. And if this is a connection that's about to happen and a lot of you, there is a reconnection happening. And this is somebody that you want to reconnect with. Um, somebody, you know, it's like a reconnection. I keep seeing reconnection. Whatever happened to you guys in the past, you need to be willing to put that aside. You need to 100% be like, I'm going to go into this relationship and I am going to start new. This is a new relationship. Whatever happened when we weren't together, whatever happened in the past relationship that we had, I'm not going to hold that against them. And other people could be like, oh my God, what are you thinking about getting back together with them? Like, how, why would you do that? Like, whatever that is, you need to put that aside too. And same thing with them. Like they, their party might be like, why would you do that? Um, but that all needs to go aside. And same thing with you. If you're like, oh, I, I, anything that somebody else says, like you let that influence you and then you hold that against your relationship. Like that's, that's not fair. Or if you hold um, old things against your relationship, like you need to put that aside because that's the only thing that's holding you back. And um, spirit is like, there is so much love and happiness in this relationship. You guys are both growing and you guys share literally the same dreams and goals. Like you guys both want to grow together. Yeah. And then as I say that, this is the card that I pulled out age. 
you guys are aging together. Like this is a relationship that is meant to happen. You guys are aging together. Here's I have, um, which is Taurus and then Pluto transformation. You guys are transforming into the star energy, all into the happiness, all into fulfillment. You do have everything that you are asking for um, and more. Like, I just feel like this, like, energy of growing. Sorry if you hear my puppy. Um, I just feel like this energy of growing, like, whatever it is that you guys have been asking for, you guys are getting that plus more. You know what I mean? Like, there's a major amount of transformation um, going on here if this is a current or um, new relationship like you guys are growing together you guys are ready to settle down um on both sides like it's like you guys are ready to settle down and just do whatever it is for you like you're transforming into something bigger like a family you guys are are making something for yourselves and you're in the energy of I have, um, whatever that means for you, where you either have a home with this person, you have a family with this person, you have a lot of love with this person. It's like, you know, that this is your person, you're transforming into that energy. And for a long time, it's like you were in a energy of like, mm, you know, like maybe it was jokes. Uh, maybe you never could fully commit or maybe like, you know what I mean? But now it's your time to, you're ready to age with this person. You're ready for this time to be forever you're in this like energy of i have this person forever this is my person and both of you are transforming into something better yeah here you go um this was like where i feel like both of you kind of were like on the outs of not wanting um something uh, serious or maybe both of you guys were kind of not fully in it, but it's not even like not fully in it. You guys just kind of joked around about like certain things or, um, you know, it, it was just different type of energy. You guys are moving out of that. Whatever was in the past is in the past. We're moving into new possibilities, new happiness. Um, it's the magician is coming out. So we're finally happy. We're in this energy of purity. Yeah, here you go. We're moving out of that negativity into the happiness. We are returning back to that love and that happiness that you want to be in, like um, that purity, whatever this relationship once was, if this is your current relationship and like you guys were just kind of like in this, you know, hard space where you guys were arguing with each other and then you would, you know, try to talk to your friends about it and then they like held things against or they were like, no, like blah, 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 like whatever it is for you, like if this was a current relationship, we're moving out of that energy. Both of you want to grow together and on both ends, you realize like it takes a lot of work on both ends and that that changes like there's magic back in the relationship we're making a break for it we're pushing all that negativity aside returning to that happiness that we once were in um and if this is a relationship where you're going into it um this is something beautiful like you are not bringing anything from the past you are taking that a hundred percent true is like you're leaving the past in the past and you're ready for that magic you're ready for that happiness to come back like that purity that you once were when you went into the relationship prior or um that purity that you once had you know what i mean like before you were broken like you're back to that original spot and you're so happy because like you feel that magic that love that um happiness a little bit more let's pull um two oracles we'll pull one for this is going to be our one for um committed and one for our singles so let's see what they say so our committed says higher self i am ready to communicate with my higher self in my dreams and become enlightened attraction i attract loving happy fulfilling relationship into my life wow singles i love yours you um are really attracting something beautiful into your life whatever that is for you um you are really like i said you're putting oh and then we have the hermit right here so we're oh wow hermit and the world right here you are doing that self-growth like you are ready to put the past in the past and move into this successful relationship singles like you are attracting nothing but this love this happiness and it's like you put your foot down right away you're like no i don't want to deal with anything but positivity if you are not positive like i don't want you around and here you are like doing that growth here you are making that success for you 
And if you are in a current relationship, ask your higher self for guidance. Um, if you are feeling like you, um, you know, it's like you're insecure in this relationship and you know you don't have any reason to be insecure or whatever it is for you, really ask your higher self for guidance. Why are you feeling insecure? Why are you feeling this way? And take the answers that they give you because they are trying to communicate with you. And through their communication, um, you know, people who are in relationships, like, it, it'll come to you and it'll bring that um, like clarity and it'll bring you back into this like happiness um, and you'll leave that insecurity in the past. So I hope everybody enjoyed the love message.